So, um, thank you for all coming, for turning up. It's great to see so many faces. Obviously, you're all aware now that our 25th anniversary fundraising has come to an end, ended on Sunday. And we are very, very pleased to announce that we have managed to raise £27,489.42, which I've been Obviously, it was agreed that the five chosen charities would each get £5,000, which is still going to go ahead. The remaining money is going to be split between the other charities that applied but weren't successful in getting chosen. So they will benefit from it too. I would just like to say how brilliant this year has been for us and your help has been greatly appreciated. Um, I know you've done some road safety work, dropped a few leaflets in a few doors on the way around, and it's been nice. It's been nice working with the local, with the local community, especially in this shop as well. And I hope it continues. I hope we can continue to have that relationship, and that the scouts and the elite will uh, be friends for a long, long time. So uh, it gives me great pleasure to give you this check, Ellen. Thank you very much, Roger. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, no, hopefully we are going to continue as Rachel says there will be some more stuff I say to all of you here now I know the Cubs the last week of term did actually start designing the badge the badge that we want to try and do which the county commissioner has actually given us permission to wear on our uniform needs to be designed by one of you guys in the group we're then hopefully going to bring the designs down here let the customers and these guys actually choose which one's going to be the actual badge that we can wear and then for a whole year we'll get it made, we'll get it worn on the uniform and you can celebrate the link that we've had with the elite and hopefully many more years to come. When you do go up to the building, if you've not already been there, you'll notice it's already starting to change. We've started digging everything out, we're starting to make a lot of changes. We've got the Prince's Trust up there at the minute, hopefully doing some more work to make your grounds really, really cool, really good for us. And it should last for a lot longer. And for more, many more Beavers, Cubs and Scouts from years to come are going to be able to enjoy some great facilities in Sleaford. And part of that is down to the generosity of Lincolnshire and in particular to Elite. So we really are pleased with what they've done and it's fantastic. Thank you very much.